Dear viewers, welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Dr. M. Sindhil Kumar. In this video, we will see about how I made the PLC based pencil winding setup. Okay. In this project, I have developed a PLC based pencil winding system. The main highlights of this particular project is all the main components are 3D printed in my personal 3D printer uh, setup. This has been completed in four days time of course. Okay, so these are the some highlights about this particular one. Uh, after seeing this video, you may be having an idea about how we can develop this kind of models not only for the vending the pencil, also for other products even on a commercial way. Okay. Now, in this uh, 3D solid model video, you could see how I made all the components in SolidWorks software. After that, I have gone for making those things in my 3D printer and some products and parts were purchased straight away. See the video now. This is the base plate, acrylic sheet. Over it, I am fixing one bearing bracket, one bearing bracket and uh, this is the bracket for Vending the pencil now. This is the pencil drum. So these are, there are two slots for vending the pencil, and these holes for fixing the potentially uh, new diameter magnet. This is the other bracket. With these two brackets in in this on these two brackets only, the pencil will be inserted. That is the another bracket for the second bearing. This is the collection tray. This is the 3D printed part for the uh, 12 volt DC motor. This is the hopper. Then this is the con acceptor uh, model and a coin collection tray. So here the idea is if you insert a 5 p coin, okay, it will give a signal. Then the motor will start rotating uh, this uh, drum through 180 degree. So that is the idea. Now we see the part list in this particular slide. Uh, these are the parts that I used for fabricating and uh, uh, developing this prototype in this particular project. A 14MR PLC. A 14MR PLC will have 8 inputs and 6 outputs. In this particular case, I required uh, two inputs and uh, two inputs for the 12 volt DC motor and one output for the LED power strip. Then a 12 volt DC 10 RPM motor, a coin acceptor, uh, this also requires a 12 volt power supply, 12 volt DC power supply and a 12 volt DC SMPS, LED strip, potential free magnetic sensor for getting the stop signal and two bearings, two neodymium magnets, DPST switch actually and all main parts are 3D printed and of course uh, I used acrylic sheet for the casing or the cabinet. Now we see all these things one by one. This is the dra main drum, there are two slots here and uh, two holes maybe there. Uh, on this slot only the uh, pencil is seated. Okay, once the pencil is seated over here and the moment you insert the 5 p coin in the coin acceptor, uh, this that will give a signal to the PLC that the PLC in turn after getting the signal that will switch on the 12 volt DC motor till the magnetic sensor is sensed. Then the motor stops. By the time the pencil will be dispensed once. Okay, so that is a setup. And these are the two brackets that acts as a guide for the pencils. And these two are the brackets for the bearing housing. So these are the two bearings and the two bearing housings actually. So this is the part for fixing, keep, uh, fixing the motor over it actually. This is the hopper. This is a collection tray. The two bearings, ID is 30 mm, OD is 42 mm. The width is uh, 7 mm, two numbers. 
a 12 volt 10 rpm motor i used two neodymium magnets of diameter 10 and uh, thickness 3 mm and this is the potential free magnetic sensor this will uh, sense the end position once this potential free magnetic sensor senses the signal then the motor will be stopped by the plc this is a led power strip once the pencil is dispensed immediately after that moment the led will blink for four times at the rate of uh, 0.2 seconds on and 0.2 seconds off and this is the 12 volt dc smps a coin acceptor so this coin acceptor is being tuned and programmed in such that uh, there is a uh, reference base slot here okay if i insert here this particular project i inserted a brass 5 p coin here okay this is the reference coin I, it, it will be kept somewhere here then only this will accept the brass fire coin if you if you insert it through this slot all other coins will not be accepted okay uh, those things will be uh, will not be accepted that side it will come back to this particular slot okay you have to take it out once you insert a brass fire pick on here this will be checked by with the reference coin okay they uh, i don't know how exactly this particular coin acceptor is working uh, maybe it sends uh, it uh, senses the diameter the thickness and some material property of the particular coin okay so once if all the three parameters are the parameters that it it it, it uh, actually checks then if all the parameters are matching with the reference coin then the coin will be accepted it will pass through this particular bay otherwise it will be sent back to this particular slot okay you, you will you can take it back once it is accepted and it will fall down through this particular bay and one pulse will be given by this particular uh, kit to the plc so that is the input signal for the plc this is the 12 mr plc board and this is the entire setup okay so you see in this particular uh, uh, photo image except with this motor all other parts are 3d printed all all are in yellow in color you see there you can see in this drum you can see one one slot for the pencil collection and a magnet is fixed here can you one neodymium neodymium magnet on this side and the other is on the rear side so now this is my laptop you could see the the model on my screen and the real prototype here okay and this is the plc program i connected uh, this plc with my laptop through rs232 port and uh, it has been uh, the plc program is been written through this uh, plc software a mitsubishi plc software now we'll see the real working of this prototype okay so the setup is here i am standing here actually so let me play the video now i'm switching on the setup okay first let me uh, put the pencils absorb uh, pencils in the hopper nearly 10 15 pencils have been put via the hopper after opening the rear lid so i am collecting the uh, coin i lid is closed now i am about to insert a fire coin now so fire p coin is being inserted here another coin is also ready now so it accepts the coin is collected on the tray now you see it is dispensed once it is dispensed then led will be blinking for four times again the second trial coin is accepted so this is dispensing the pencil and the uh, led is blinking for four for four times 
So this is the real uh, working of this particular prototype. As I said earlier at the beginning of uh, this uh, video presentation, I said this is this would have given you a, an overview about how we can develop not only a pencil vending setup using PLC, but having getting some idea and knowledge from this video, from my video, you can develop a vending setup for your own product in your own way. So that is my main intention of creating this video and airing it in uh, my YouTube channel. Okay. Thank you so much for watching this particular uh, video. I if you are really interested and delighted, uh, please subscribe my channel and uh, tell your fellow colleagues and students to use and see this video to learn to how to develop this kind of uh, vending setup for their own uh, projects. Thank you. Good day.